So three parts vinegar. Still waiting on the answer for the oil. I told you three parts oil to one part vinegar. So if I'm using three quarters of a cup. Thank you. That's the correct answer. Two and a quarter cups of oil. Alright. And now, instead of sitting and whisking my hand for minutes upon minutes upon minutes, I'm going to do this as quickly with a immersion blender or what we call the stick blender. So this will go quickly and I can move on to my other demos and you can begin your grenade. Two heaping tablespoons or they wouldn't be regularly packed. When you measure brown sugar, you always pack it. So two packed tablespoons of brown sugar. One and a half tablespoons of Dijon mustard. One and a half tablespoons. Two tablespoons of garlic. Now it doesn't have to be minced, just kind of rub chop or smash, because we're gonna blend them in here. And four tablespoons of shallots. Four tablespoons. And I'm gonna finish it with salt, a little bit of black pepper. So not making time, but I'm going to wait till I've created my emulsion first. You could put a, a bay seasoning in now and then adjust it at the end. Instead of doing it twice, I'm going to get it So you don't need to let that sit, obviously, for any period of time. No, because there were no dry. Oh, okay. If there were dry uh, herbs in there. Hour, you want to let them sit there so they can soak up that juice so they can rehydrate. Oh, uh, you can use vegetable. I'm using a blend of olive oil and canola oil. I had someone ask me last night, how do you make something light? Is there a light oil like if Yes, there is a light. Okay. But with light, uh, in fact, I suppose light would be light. Alright. So first, I'm going to blend up. Now I'm doing this in the my blending up our ingredients. No oils in here yet. This is just vinegar and raw ingredients. What? Hmm? Yeah, without the blender you would whisk it, it would take you a lot longer. What about this? This is our blender? friend when it comes to making vinegar. What if you have a regular blender? Can you, just do it in you can do it in a regular blender, a food processor, oh, okay. or even in a, uh, like a mixer. Uh, so with like a water a whip. Like a would do it? Like a yeah. hand mixer? Yeah, would. yeah, that would work as well. That'd be a lot easier than if I did. All our ingredients are blended well. Now we'll start drizzling in my oil. And not only does the blender add, I mean, mix it very well together. But it's going to add a little bit of air to it, make it a little bit lighter and thicker. Look how thick it's getting already with just one cup of the oil. See that?
now I'm just going to season it. Start with about a half a teaspoon of uh, salt, a quarter teaspoon of black pepper, a pinch of cayenne pepper, a pinch of nutmeg. <laughs> all three peppers in here because all three peppers have a different flavor in um, How much flavor do you have? How much salt and pepper you start it? A teaspoon of salt, a quarter teaspoon of pepper. So you see how thick that's got? Just like a salad dressing. How about that? Ha, 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 ha.